Hi guys, so today I'm going to be talking about my new foundation that I ordered off eBay that I've been seeing a lot of people talk about on YouTube and on the internet. It's called Dermacol and it's from Prague. It is a European um, foundation. It's called Dermacol Film Studio Bar Randov Prague Makeup Cover. It has SPF 30, it's hypoallergenic, and it's waterproof. Um, supposedly this is um, made for films, so the coverage is high coverage. Um, supposedly it was sold to like Hollywood or something, is what I've read on the internet. So it's really super pigmented. I believe it's like 50% um, pigment if I remember correctly. And I've seen really good things about it. So just keep watching and um, you're going to see me for the first time using it and my first impressions. So just keep watching and I'll show you how I apply it. So I have washed, moisturized, and primed my face. And now I got my damp sponge and I am going to spread the foundation with my finger all over. I'm scared to use too much. I'm just gonna go in with my sponge. And stipple pat to blend it out. I don't think this is an everyday kind of foundation since it's made for films but I've been seeing a lot about it and it's pretty cheap I wanted to try it out down my chin and it out it dries pretty fast so you kind of have to work fast Might have to mix this in with another foundation because this looks really light. It's really pretty. Kind of hard to see on camera. Definitely evened out my skin tone. You can even use this as a concealer, a cream concealer. Getting close so you can see. Forehead, the wrinkles. Looks really nice. Looks pretty matte. 
little bit of my red is still showing through, but I'm okay with that. Alright, so I'm going to go put on the rest of my makeup and I'll be back. So my final thoughts on the Dermacol foundation. So I love it. It is beautiful. The camera doesn't do it justice. Um, makes my skin look really good. It's pretty matte. Since I have oily skin, that's okay. Um, this little tube, it looks small. It's one float ounce, which is normal um, for a foundation. Um, but this will last like forever because I maybe used maybe like half of my pinky nail. Maybe. Maybe even half of that. Didn't use that. I mean, it. you don't use hardly any of this. So this will last forever. Um, I really like the finish of it. And as long as it stays, like I hope it does, I feel like this is really good. Um, I wouldn't say it's everyday makeup. Um, but definitely would be good for... It has SPF in it. Um... So it might have some flashback. I'll take some um, flash photography to see if it has any flashback because usually SPF does that. Um, but yeah, it looks really good. And it's like really cheap. Um, since a lot of it's becoming popular, so the eBay and Amazon is really jacking up the prices. But I think I paid like $12 on eBay. It took forever to get here. It took like two weeks three weeks um, to get here but um, the shipping was maybe like three bucks like it wasn't anything so it's a really good price I'm um, compared to like my Marc Jacobs like this is just as good and hopefully if it stays I will let y'all know if it has good staying power um, I did not set it with a powder so that usually shows you um, how good the longevity of it is so I'll see it's like 2 o'clock in the afternoon, so I'm not going to be wearing it for a really long time. But um, we'll see how long it wears for the rest of the day. And I hope you enjoyed this video, and hope to see you next time. Bye, guys.